the Aston Martin Vantage offers a dignified take on the high-performance Grand Touring Car Blueprint. Featuring a new 656-horsepower twin-turbo V8, a revised interior, and several deceivingly minor exterior updates, the 2025 Vantage is improved in every metric. Sadly, the 12-cylinder Vantage is no longer, but the new V8 brings a 128-horsepower increase over the outgoing engine that should assuage any angst over it having four fewer cylinders. The Vantage's athletic chassis gets a boost with revised suspension geometry and improved dynamic software, and the gasoline V8 provides visceral thrills via hasty acceleration accompanied by a sonorous exhaust note. The refreshed interior, while still snug, features upgraded hand-stitched leather and a modern infotainment system. Thankfully, a handful of physical controls for critical functions, including drive mode, exhaust selection, and HVAC settings remain. What's new for 2025 Aston Martin Vantage? Exterior revisions include a new front bumper with a significantly larger grille and new LED headlamps. New front fenders shroud new 21-inch alloy wheels, and there are new side vents located behind the wheel arches. The interior features a comprehensive overhaul with a new center console infotainment touchscreen, a single instrument display that replaces the old 3-gauge digital cluster, and a single gear selection lever that supplants the Astan's former pushbuttons. The 4-liter twin turbo has been extensively reworked to yield 656 horsepower, a 128 horsepower increase over the previous model. The new 2025 Aston Martin Vantage price is expected to start around $190,000 and go up to $200,000 depending on the trim and options. New Aston Martin Vantage Interior Features Though Aston has never been shy of offering numerous interior options and upgrades, including a full leather interior, heated and ventilated seats, a carbon fiber steering wheel, and embroidered headrests, the overall effect could feel a bit random. The 2025 car sees a thoroughly revised interior. Yes, it's still a snug space with just enough room for two, but modern touches, including a new center console and an infotainment touchscreen, add a bit of modernity and cohesiveness. Interior cubby storage is scarce except for a shallow center console bin and door pockets. The convertible's power-operated fabric roof folds up and down quickly and features a Z-shape that Astan says helps save trunk space. While the Vantage Roadster has a slightly smaller trunk than the coupe, we're told that it's still able to fit a full-sized golf bag. A 12-5-inch touchscreen with new software replaces the previous 8-inch unit. Wireless Apple CarPlay and Android Auto are finally standard equipment, and the navigation integrates what three words destination input. The new Aston Martin app works in sync with the vehicle, the app, and Aston Martin servers via an onboard cellular service for a fully connected ownership experience. Standard audio is a 390-watt, 11-speaker Aston system, but a 1A170-watt 15-speaker Bowers & Wilkins system is on offer for audiophiles. New Aston Martin Vantage Engine Performance as with the previous model, the new Vantage's twin-turbo 4-liter V8 has AMD DNA. But it's been significantly reworked for increased output with new turbos, revised cam profiles, optimized compression ratios, and improved cooling. Output now sits at 656 horsepower and 590 pound-feet of torque, an increase of 128 horsepower and 85 pound-feet over the prior engine in the Vantage F1 edition previously the most powerful Vantage variant. Power is transmitted to the rear axle via an 8-speed automatic transmission. The 2025 car benefits from a 7% stiffer chassis, revised active dampers, and faster acting dynamic controls with progressive engagement for the stability and traction control systems. We're confident the improvement will only enhance the Vantage's lively but predictable handling that makes it hilariously good fun on a racetrack.